The Associated Press has not called the presidential race at this point because neither of the candidates has gained the 270 electoral college votes that they would need to claim victory. So this morning, uh, President Donald Trump appeared at the White House um, and he made uh, premature claims of victories in several states and said he would take the election to the Supreme Court. Um, that assertion of victory at this point does not match the information and data available to us, and so we are not calling the race at this point. Well, thank you very much. This is a fraud on the American public. This is an embarrassment to our country. We were getting ready to win this election. Frankly, we did win this election. We did win this election. So our goal now is to ensure the integrity for the good of this nation. This is a very big moment. This is a major fraud in our nation. We want the law to be used in a proper manner. So we'll be going to the U.S. Supreme Court. We want all voting to stop. We don't want them to find any ballots at 4 o'clock in the morning and add them to the list, okay? It's, it's a very sad, it's a very sad moment. To me, this is a very sad moment. And we will win this. And we, as far as I'm concerned, we already have won it. So I just want to thank you. And I want to thank all of our support. I want to thank all of the people that worked with us. So the president said that he would take the election to the Supreme Court. It's not clear at this point what actual legal challenges he and his campaign would plan to make. So obviously we'll be just waiting to see what legal steps um, President Trump actually takes.